How much do US products cost in Thailand compared to back home? Watch this video and find out. Having previously done a comparison of what UK products cost in Thailand compared to back home in the UK, I was encouraged to do a similar video focusing mainly on US products. So I went back to Villa Market to check out the prices of some popular US brands. I compared the prices in this Thai supermarket to the prices on the Walmart website in the US. I did the price check on the 1st of August 2017 and on that day the exchange rate gave you 33.3 baht for one dollar. I converted all the US prices from Walmart to Thai baht to make the comparison simpler. I found 30 products in Villa Market which I price checked. For this video I'll do a countdown starting with the products that had the smallest price difference compared to the US going up to the products that had the biggest price difference compared to the US. First we have Ritz crackers which are actually significantly cheaper in Thailand. They cost 59 baht at Villa Market whereas they cost 85 baht at Walmart. That is a price difference of 26 baht which makes Ritz crackers 31% cheaper in Thailand. Next we have Oreos which cost 30 baht in Thailand but 33 baht in Walmart. So they are 10% cheaper in Thailand. The last of the US products which is cheaper in Thailand is Fruit Loops. In Thailand the price is 82 baht and in the US it is 84 baht. A difference of 2 baht or 2%. Tomato soup costs 56 baht in Thailand and 53 baht in the US, a difference of 3 baht. So tomato soup is 6% more expensive in Thailand. Sardines are up next. In Thailand they cost 99 baht whereas you can get them in the US for just 85 baht, a difference of 14 baht or 14%. A small bar of Hershey's chocolate will cost you 32 baht in Thailand. In the US it will cost 27 baht. The difference is 5 baht which means it is 20% more expensive in Thailand. You like Miracle Whip? Then you have to pay 135 baht to get it in Thailand. In the USA you can get it for 111 baht. You pay 24 baht more for it in Thailand which is a price difference of 22%. Mustard is next. It costs 77 baht in Thailand and in the US it costs just 52 baht. 25 baht more in Thailand or 48%. Macaroni and cheese. In Thailand it costs 79 baht. I also included this product in my last comparison where it was more expensive in the UK. But in the US it is less expensive. Just 48 baht which is 31 baht cheaper. A difference of 64%. Pringles. If you want the authentic Pringles they cost 85 baht in Thailand. You can get Thai Pringles which comes in a smaller box and each Pringle has a smaller size. They are cheaper. But here we are comparing like for like. In the US original Pringles cost 50 baht. Price difference of 35 baht. Pringles is 70% more expensive in Thailand. If you don't like Pringles Maybe prunes is your thing. In Thailand they cost 169 baht, in the US 99 baht. 70 baht difference which is 70%. Cream style corn. In Thailand the price is 69 baht, in the US the price is 40 baht. You pay 29 baht more in Thailand which is the same as 71%. Another canned product, kidney beans. They cost 80 baht in Thailand and 46 baht in the US. 34 baht more in Thailand or a surcharge of 74%. Raisins cost 209 baht in Thailand compared to just 114 baht in the US. You pay 95 baht more in Thailand. That is 84%. A simple bottle of bud cost 81 baht at Villa Market in Thailand. At Walmart you can get it for 43 baht. That is 38 baht cheaper than Thailand. You pay 87% extra for Budweiser in Thailand. What goes well with a bottle of Bud? 
pretzels, of course. 159 baht they cost in Bangkok. In America, they cost 83 baht, a 93% difference. This is Sandy Becker saying, keep cooking with Crisco. You want to keep cooking with Crisco like Andy Becker? Well, in Thailand, that will cost you 145 baht. In the US, you could have got it for 73 baht. 72 baht difference. Cooking with Crisco is 100% more expensive in Thailand than it is in America. Big red letters stand for the Jell-O family. Oh, the big red letters stand for the Jell-O family. That's Jell-O. Yum, yum, yum. Jell-O pudding. Yum, yum, yum. Jell-O. Do you say yum, yum to Jell-O too? If you do, then get ready to pay 89 baht in Thailand. In America, Jell-O is just 43 baht. The difference is 46 baht or 109%. Orange juice on ice is nice, but is the best advice to buy real Florida orange juice in Thailand? 208 baht it costs. That OJ would only cost 99 baht in Walmart. You pay 110 baht more in Thailand. That's 111%. Anyone who's been to Thailand will know that Thai orange juice tastes different to real Florida orange juice. Thais add salt to their orange juice and it's hard to find western tasting orange juice unless you buy this expensive imported stuff. Nothing more American than peanut butter. It will cost you 179 baht in Thailand. In the US it would cost 83 baht. A difference of 96 baht. That makes peanut butter 115% more expensive in Thailand. Pancake syrup. It costs 235 baht in Thailand. In the US, it costs just 93 baht. 142 baht difference. A 155% price hike for Thailand. Spaghetti sauce. 169 baht in Thailand. Just 66 baht in the US. You pay 103 baht more in Thailand. That is 156% extra. Granola for breakfast. If you want it in Thailand, be prepared to pay 419 baht for it. In the US, you could have got it for 161 baht. You pay 258 baht more in Thailand. That is 160% extra. How about fruit cocktail? Well, in Thailand, it will set you back 149 baht. In the US, you would only have had to rustle up 56 baht. You pay 93 baht more in Thailand. A difference of 166%. Pancake mix. It costs 303 baht to get the mix in Thailand. In America, the same pack costs 111 baht. A difference of 192 baht. That is 173%. You want some Caesar dressing on a salad. You pay 189 baht for that in Thailand. The dressing would only cost you 66 baht in America. 123 baht difference. You pay 187% more in Thailand. Pumpkin in a can costs 200 baht in Thailand. The same can costs just 63 baht in the US. You pay 137 baht more in Thailand, which is a full 219% extra. Cream of wheat may be good to eat, but if you want to have it every day in Thailand, it will cost you 377 baht to be precise. Just 166 baht it costs in America. You pay 261 baht more in Thailand. That's 225%. You want Uncle Ben's rice in Thailand. Thailand is the land of rice, and they don't seem too fond of foreign rice. Uncle Ben's rice costs 219 baht in Thailand, but only 66 baht in the US. 153 baht price difference. 
So if you want Uncle Ben's rice, you have to pay 232% extra. Now we have reached our final item, Betty Crocker's cake mix. Cost 147 baht in Thailand. In the US, it would only have cost 39 baht to make the same cake. You pay 108 baht more for cake in Thailand, which is 277%. That concludes the price comparison of US products in Thailand versus the US. Overall, the 30 products cost 4,530 baht in Thailand and just 2,185 baht back in America. That's an overall price difference of 107%. Thanks for watching the price comparison of US products in Thailand and America. Please click like if you found this video to be useful and please subscribe to this channel to stay updated about new videos about the cost of living in Bangkok.